How we doing? Yeah, you're wrong. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Let's. <laughs> I sounded just like my three-year-old right there, didn't I? Come on, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. I'm Mickey Mouse. Hi, everybody. My Hello. name is Jenny Craig. Jeremy Craig. And we are here at Copper Bottom Craft Distillery in Holly Hill, Florida. Yes. And it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas in it here. It is. You have done such a good job. Jeremy and his mom has knocked out Christmas decor in the distillery. Wow. Garland, lights, 13-foot Christmas tree. Lots of stuff. Yep. Nothing up here yet. Sorry. We'll, we'll get there. Next week. Lights, maybe next week. Next yeah. week. How's everybody doing? It is Thursday. There's something brisk in the air. I mean, yeah, it's cold. Well, it's cold first That's of all. the problem. But people are like in a good mood today. Really? Do yeah. you want to start your thing so we can make sure it's working? <laughs> We've done this before where it just doesn't work, so maybe we should check it out and make sure it is. Yeah. Oh, it hey, says look we're it. live. It says we're, there's a live video. It says we're live right now. Right. So coming up this week is repeal day. All right. What does that even mean, Jenny? Oh, let me be play teacher. <laughs> oh boy. This ought to be I good. should never be a teacher ever. Hold that's, on, it's that's not... very true. Okay. You're... Just click on it. There we go. Yeah. I look silly when I flip my hair like that. Yeah, well, I just saw that. Just uh, we're a couple <laughs> seconds behind, I think. <laughs> anyway, okay, so repeal day was prohibition people. Here's a little history lesson for you. Prohibition was 1920 to 1933. How'd you know that, Jenny? <laughs> because I wrote it on the wall. <laughs> yes, because it's on the wall. It's written on the wall. 13 years. 13 years with no liquor in this country. Well. No beer? No legal liquor. No. Nothing? Nothing. Dry. Dry. Georgia, dry Sundays? Just like Georgia. Well, not Georgia anymore, but after, when, after when, we lived, when we lived there. Yeah, afternoon Sunday. So imagine Georgia before noon on Sundays. It's the whole country. Actually, I think it was. Yeah, it's, I think you could drink in Georgia on Sundays now. No, you cannot. I was just there in Savannah. You can't. Really? Mm hmm. Crazy. Anyway. I don't know. The whole country, y'all, dry for 13 years until old Roosevelt came along. Old, old Rosie, huh? Oh. <laughs> Rosie Roosevelt. <laughs> Well, Roosevelt came along December 5th, 1933, and he repealed. Which amendment was it that he repealed? Did I write that somewhere? You probably did, but it's not big enough for you to see. The fifth? No, first? No, 30th. The first? <laughs> Give me a break. The 18th amendment was prohibition. The 21st amendment repealed prohibition. Babe. I'm smart. I did not know that you knew this kind of stuff. What else do you know? I can't. We don't have enough time. That's not true. I Did you brush up on that before? No. You no. knew that. Off yeah. the top of your head. 18th and 21st. Yes. I'm not going to. I've got a little, for whatever reason, I've got a little thing in my head that goes through that. And I know it. I just, I've always known it. Maybe you should go on Jeopardy. I'm pretty good at Jeopardy. In my, in my living room, on my couch, I'm really good at Jeopardy. Anyway, repeal day, December 5th, 1933. Guess what date's coming up, y'all? December 5th? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay, so let's do the math. 2018 minus 1933. Now you're asking too What much. repeal day is this? I don't know. Is anyone out there? <laughs> <laughs> Anybody there can do math? It's, do math? Um, anyway, there's a, an anniversary <laughs> coming of repeal day, and we want to <laughs> celebrate it big. Maybe you should have brushed up on that. <laughs> What's 2018 minus 1933? Something five. Sure. I, listen, I, I'm not going to attempt to do maths in my, okay. in my head. I think it's like 75. Anyway, um, <clears throat> what have... It's a lot of years. So every year we've tried to do something on repeal day. And this year... And we never do. <laughs> this year <laughs> we are going to. We're going to. And it is next Wednesday. Mark your calendars. Here comes the announcement. Are you people ready? Whoa. <laughs> I'm about to fight. Tell him. Speaking of, never mind, I'm not going to go into that. What? Nothing. <laughs> I got, what? I got, I got into it with a guy this morning. I pulled into the distillery trying to steal some metal out of the back of the place. So speaking of fighting. You shouldn't have said that. Almost. I know. I almost got into a fight this morning. Sorry. You almost got into a fight? Well, I told him. You were going to beat up a guy trying to take our metal? I wasn't going to beat him up. I told him to get out of here. Was he like, did he look like he needed the metal? No. No. 
Either way, he should have asked me for it instead of just taking it. This has taken a turn. Taking a turn. Well, you talk about fighting. I wasn't going to fight him, but I might have. People are wondering <laughs> right now what we're doing next Wednesday. Oh, so what I are we doing have next a party. Wednesday? I want to have a repeal day party. On a Wednesday? On it's a Wednesday. It's a school night. Don't care. Wednesday, next Wednesday, December 5th. But here's what you're going to do, all you people. We're not really having a party, are we? I want to. Why not? Okay. You know what we're going to make it? A beer barrel release day party! Ow! There you go. It's out. <laughs> so, well, yeah, so maybe you, maybe we could say it a little bit easier so that people can actually understand. It, we're gonna be releasing <laughs> we're gonna be releasing our second batch of the beer barrel rum on Wednesday. Repeal day. So we're gonna do this one is the this was actually one that a lot of people were really excited about. When I told them about it, this is the one, uh, the barrel that we got back from Wapsops out in Sanford. Uh, this is the one they aged their coconut paradiso ale in our rum barrel. So I'm going to tell you, it's not going to have, it's not going to be like super overpowered. It's not going to be a coconut rum by any means, but it's going to be have some really cool flavors. So check it out. So you've been tasting it, testing it as it's gone along. Yeah. What are you picking up? How does it compare? From the 375 bottles that we had of the last... 357 bottles. 357 bottles that we had of the last beer barrel rum. Who's it, in charge of marketing I don't know. here? It's completely different. Completely different. How so? The other one... Well, the other one was aged in a stout barrel. So you got a lot of cocoa and coffee and cherry and raisin type notes. This one you get some of those subtle... Subtle beer notes, but you also get that subtle um, coconut flavor as well. So you get a, you get a lot of rum. What are you laughing at? <laughs> get a lot of rum, and you get a lot of a lot of those rum gold rum flavors, but you get those subtle hints of the coconut and that little bit of ale type beer flavor. How do, how do you like it compared to? Um, oh, it's black. just completely different. I like I like them both. I haven't. It's not bottled yet, so you know, unless we have some. It's going to be done on Wednesday unless something crazy happens. You know, I can't bottle everything, but I've got it, got it we'll ready to go, it. and it's going to be ready. But yeah, December fifth, two thousand eighteen. Eighteen. Thank you, Beth King. Eighty-five years prohibition. Eighty-five years. It's a long time. It's a repeal release day miracle. Miracle. I love this. <laughs> I'm sure you do. I got it. I'm putting up the event as soon as we're done talking here. Okay. We're gonna have a. And if we're gonna do something. Maybe we'll get yeah. a food truck out here. Oh, you know what I have? I have the beer that we did with Greg. So this is actually the beer that was released um, at Wapsops that had our, you know, that was aged in our rum barrel. So this is actually the beer that he did. It's a coconut parody, so ale. It's very, very good. Um, yeah. So this is what he used, and we're gonna get some of those flavors out of it in our in our little rum. In our little run. Yeah. Um, hopefully we can get around the same amount of bottles out, I would hope. And this would be a fantastic, do I even need to say this? Is everyone already thinking? It'd be a fantastic holiday season gift. Mm, it's true. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't even know. I I'm not 100% sure um, all the details on it yet because I haven't, like I said, I haven't put it in a bottle just yet. But I've got the barrel pulled and ready to go. So um, hopefully here pretty soon in the next day or two, we'll get it in a bottle. And I can let you know exactly what the proof is going to be because that changes a little bit. Um, with the first beer barrel rum is 86 proof. This one uh, might be a little more, a little less. We'll see. We'll see what tastes the best. <clears throat> and then this one's going to get to hand number all the labels once we figure out how many we get. Yeah, a couple long nights of that. You give me hand massages? Sure. <laughs> no, you won't. That's yeah. Sure, I will. <laughs> you will. When you're done. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that is our big announcement for today. We could not be more excited. Repeal day, release day, let's have a party. It's the holiday season. Everybody, like I was saying at the very beginning of this, it's brisk outside. It's brisk. People are in a good mood. It's like the cool has just got their little feather tails all it's brisk. super snappered. It's brisk today, but I think it's warming up though, isn't it? I hope. I hope so. I can't take yeah, this cold I hate weather. This. I know there are a lot of you, you people watching that are, are really in cold weather, but What this is, is it cold. outside? What is this, 50? No, it's over, it's over 60 now. Oh, really? Yeah. Feels like 50 <laughs> or 40, I don't know. Uh, it feels colder than it should be. It was it was pretty cold this morning. 
Oh, absolutely. It was cold yesterday. Oh, it was, now it was cold yesterday. Definitely. So. It's not, I don't know. It's not too bad. I don't know. I haven't been out in a little bit. Um, so, Beth King wants to know if she can refill her mini barrel with the new rum. You could. I don't see why not. And she also wants to know if she can get a bottle for knowing, for being able to do math. <laughs> um. <laughs> um. Um, Jeremy Martin said you should have beat the guy up. Yeah, I probably should have. No, I shouldn't have. I was, try I was in the holidays. You know, it was a little nip in the air. It was cold out. I didn't want to hurt my hand. You know, I got a bottle stuff this week. I didn't want to do all that. Yeah, so if anybody wants to come by, Beth, if you want a bottle, you come on by and help us <laughs> bottle some stuff, and then we can talk about it. Because I don't know how you're going to pull this off. Oh, we'll make it happen. I've done it before. Do it again. You know, something else that's um, a big deal today... What's a big deal today? Oh, it's our little baby's birthday. It is. She is two years old today. Two years old. Little Macy. And um, we're going to have a little pizza party here at the distillery tonight so Daddy can be a part of the birthday celebration. Oh, we're doing tonight. that here? Yeah. Oh, cool. Yep. Sounds good. Anybody who comes in, just pretend like it's not happening. It's fine. <laughs> or bring balloons and then okay. have a piece of pizza. Yeah, whatever, whatever you want. Whatever you want. Um, Either way. So we're open from 5 to 8 tonight. It's Wednesday, right? No, today's Thursday. Today's Thursday. It's been a crazy week with all the holidays and everything. I can't remember what day it is And then is Tuesday, we took the, I woke up and believed that firmly that today was Tuesday. We took Tuesday off and took Macy and Carmen, our other daughter, to Disney World on Tuesday. Yeah. To go celebrate a birthday. That was fun. It was a blast. Yeah. Tell them about the Epcot thing. I don't remember exactly what it's called. Is it, What is it called? It's the candlelight procession thing or whatever we did we went and saw that at epcot friday or tuesday night it's really really good if you get a chance to do that get out there and do that it's really really cool yeah it was oh yeah it was alfonso what's his last name robero 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 i don't know carlton carlton he was there reading it reading it out reading the christmas story to us it was awesome it was really good they did a good job our kids slept through it but yeah, better than probably the better. Well, it's probably better that way, let's be honest. <laughs> um, so yeah, that was awesome. That was at Epcot. But we've had a really good week and we're excited to celebrate our sweet little two-year-old tonight. She is a bundle of fun. <laughs> yeah, definitely come in and check out the decorations too. We, my mom did a good job with it, so check it out. And they've got the new, she got the new crate. Your mom got the new crate. Yeah, well, we've got all kinds of um, new basket baskets stuff. and stuff. So if you're thinking holidays, gift basket, come here. Start here first because yeah, we've got all out. kinds of new, new looking fun baskets, and we still have the raffle going too. Yep. Um, a dollar per ticket is one hundred and eighty dollar value for the basket. Yep. Buy a ticket, and maybe you'll win the basket. We'll draw that on December twenty second. We got some new shirts and stuff in as well. I'm actually picking up some more tomorrow. Huh? The long sleeve ones are back. The white ones. The white ones, yeah, those are they're going to be back tomorrow, so we'll have those too. I know a lot they're of people like, are asking about those. They're cool, like fishing guys. Yeah, shirts. they're cool. I like those. People like them. They sold out really quick, so we had to get some more. Hmm. To the back, or they will be tomorrow. What else? Anything else? Mm -hmm. We have a lot of parties coming up. We have parties coming up, but we still have room for more. So if anybody wants a, um, anybody needs a space for a holiday party or Yeah, if or you're thinking you? like, oh, it's too last minute at this point, you probably don't have any dates open, just like give us a chance to tell you that. Yeah, no, we have, we have dates open. So come on through and we'll, uh, we'll see if we got one for you and we'll make it work. Yeah, it's really fun. It is fun. Okay. What else? I don't it? know. I'm just so excited about the repeal, <laughs> release, ah. Repeal day, release day miracle. Yeah. This one's with, like I said, this one's with Wops Ops out in Sanford. Um, they did their coconut parody so ale in our, in our rum barrel. So we're going to see what comes out. I think it's going to be really good. I'm excited. I loved the last one. So yeah, I'm sure I will it's going to be just good. completely different. That's the cool thing about this project is every release is going to be completely different. Um, so everyone, you know, it's going to be a new experience every time like a new experience every time <laughs> every time <laughs> all right you guys uh thank you for listening and watching yeah Is that that's it? all i got that's, <laughs> do you want to turn the camera off you want me to turn it off i will but i need you to do the carlton i'm not doing that come on i'm not sure i know how to do any of that so i'm just gonna say thank you god bless god bless america <laughs> happy repeal day happy repeal day december 5th Merry Christmas. We'll see you December 5th. All that. <laughs> Goodbye now.